Hi, this is a quick three minute video on this. Okay, in this video we've got the equation of a curve C is y equals x squared plus 3x plus 4 and we're being asked to transform it to curve S under the translation vector 4, 6 which is basically 4 is going to be in the x direction. Now just be a little bit careful about that because while it's in the positive x direction it means then that the function is going to be changed by negative 4. Okay, if you're not sure about this, uh, if you let me know in the comments I'll be able to direct you towards a playlist. So I can change this in the x direction to rather than y equals x squared plus 3x plus 4, I'm going to change that to y equals x minus 4 squared plus 3 times x minus 4 plus 4. Okay, so that deals with it in the x direction. I've got a y direction. Now this is slightly different because effectively all I need is the function of x which I've got which I've now just changed to x minus 4 squared etc but this time I'm going to add 6 to the end of it. So the answer to the question without any form of simplifi simplification is going to be x minus 4 squared plus 3 times x minus 4 and rather than plus 4 at the end I'm going to have plus 10. Now that will answer this question and it will give you the full two marks. Now it does say you do not need to simplify the equation. I actually think it would be worthwhile simplifying the equation so what I would do is I would just also write this as y equals x squared minus 5x plus 14 which is what you'll get if you expand out the brackets there and that would be perfectly fine for this question. I hope it's been useful. I'll look forward to seeing you inside the next video.